Hi, I'm Christina from Olympus UK and in this video I'm going to share my tips how I take pet portraits at home. So let's have a look at the settings first. I use my OMD EM1 Mark III with the brand new 12 to 45 f4 lens and some of the shots I've taken outside in a garden I use the 40 to 150 f2.8. So, if you press the OK button on the back of your camera, you'll be able to see the super control panel. And this is where most of the shooting settings can be adjusted very easily. Um, I left the ISO on auto. I have wide balance on auto as well. I used a five point focus area, continuous autofocus, and a low sequential mode. So let's get shooting. When indoors, it's always best to position yourself and your subject nearby a large window. It can get really nice soft lighting um, just by doing that. And uh, you could play around with shadows and if you've got harsh sunlight coming in, then uh, this will create a nice high contrast image for you. Try to shoot quite low um, on your subject level or try to shoot from um, unexpected sides or angles. It could create kind of fun images. Try to shoot from the side and um, a lower angle as well. So you can really mix those up. Use treats to grab their attention. This is a great way to make sure they look in the direction where you want them to be. Try to deliberately overexpose or underexpose your images. Combine dark backgrounds for a higher contrast image. Get close. With the 12 to 45 f4 lens, you'll be able to focus as close as 12 centimeter away. So you can create quite fun wide angle macro images as well. As mentioned previously, I used low sequential mode and it was able to capture motion. And this is where my cat was yawning. You can use an interesting color or any other props to pop a little bit more interest to your image. And if your pet is posing for you, just keep shooting. I hope this inspired you to take your own pet portraits. If you'd like to share any of your images, please pop them in the comment section below. Stay home, stay safe and thanks for watching.